Today we're gonna to make French toast. I've got my ingredients laid out. And this French toast is really simple to make. I've got two eggs, some really good pure Mexican vanilla, and cinnamon, and of course, bread. This is homemade bread that is gluten-free homemade bread. So today, I guess you're, we're gonna be making gluten-free French toast. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're gonna break our eggs into our pan here. And this is gonna be what we dip our bread into. We have our eggs broken into our, our dish and we're gonna beat them up. Oh, one ingredient I forgot to add. Forgot that, rice milk. That's important too. I've got the rice milk poured out. It's approximately half a cup. And I'm gonna add that to our egg mixture and continue to stir it. I'm gonna go ahead and start the skillet here to approximately 300 degrees. I've never done this before, so we're gonna test out and see how, or what temperature I need to put it at. We're gonna add some cinnamon. Not too much, you can very easily overpower your dish with too much cinnamon. That's probably enough. And then mix that up. And then add vanilla. Carefully measured, of course. and spray some non-stick uh, cooking spray on top of the griddle. Now one at a time I will dip the bread into the mixture and let it soak up the, the egg and vanilla mixture. Of course, make a mess. That's that's key in the kitchen, right? Making a mess. And then we're gonna go ahead and add that or put that on the griddle. And move on to the next one. These pieces of bread are a little bit too big. Uh, maybe I can fit two in there. How about that? Wow, there's a lot of leftover juices. I'll just pour those on top. That'll be a little, little bit extra flavor. Now I'm going to start in the microwave for one minute to heat up my syrup that I'll be putting on my French toast. That's probably the noise you're hearing in the background right now is the microwave running. Check the uh, French toast, make sure it's cooking up okay. I think I'm gonna increase the temperature a little bit to 350. Go ahead and flip these right now. 
probably going to, yeah, it's not toasting up as, as well as I thought. So probably let that sit for a little bit and uh, through the magic of video, we'll fast forward to them coming off of the griddle. So I've done my first flip of the French toast. I'm late for the, sec the, the back side now to, to cook up nicely. Seems to be toasting okay. I'm gonna make sure I get all the little crispins in there too, because those are those are worth eating. They're not burnt, they're just the little fragments of the egg mixture that kind of dripped off on from the toast. And I've got my fresh maple syrup heat up in the microwave and ready to go. It looks like they're done, so I'm going to go ahead and take them off the heat. Plate them up. I just love the little crispins that are left. That's what I call crispy. Add my syrup. And enjoy.